I'm curious. I'd love to hear a little bit about your musical theater background and what you're interested in that. What are some of your favorite uh, musical theaters? Let me give you actually a backstory to that question. I personally thought that I hated musicals just because I guess I've had, I don't know what, I just grew up, I guess, never being really introduced to them. And maybe one of the ones that I was introduced to, like, you know, like in high school, like they they take you to like the opera and like, I just wasn't interested in that kind of stuff, right? Or like, yeah. you know, you'd see like, um, what's it called? Uh, what's that classic uh the nutcracker where like i was right. suckered into seeing the nutcracker for one of my friend's kids and i didn't realize there was no speaking in the thing so now you just yeah. have all these people for three hours just dancing around doing look and it was fun to see the kid but like so i just had all these experiences and then somebody introduced me to hamilton and i really enjoyed it then i went into in the heights yeah. and then i looked into dear evan hansen and like i started mm-hmm. kind of going down this path i was like oh i actually this stuff is really even from a songwriter perspective like myself yeah. like these are really well written songs and they tell a really good story so i would love to hear yeah. a little bit of your backstory and i don't know if i sound like a um musical theater noob by mentioning hamilton first because i was like i feel oh, like hamilton's that's like great the typical like, like oh you know yeah yeah it's hamilton but it's quite a few people's kind of especially now introduction and like mm. what a great introduction i mean you know mm-hmm. lin-manuel miranda <laughs> a great mm-hmm. lyricist so it's amazing yeah especially contemporary music i was always i was kind of brought up more on like old classic musical theater like uh calamity jane um oklahoma seven brides of seven brothers like the western types and like mm. west side story i know there's a new one i haven't actually seen that um but the old west side story those are the ones that i kind of grew up on like my fair lady like all these and i just fell in love <laughs> i was like wow this is so cool and i remember going to university and singing these classical musical theater songs and everyone kind of was bringing more contemporary things like i mean mm. hamilton came out a few years later i think i think my second year but um these more contemporary kind of feeling uh songs and i was like whoa <laughs> i'm i'm more of a legit uh, musical theater singer and i was then introduced to more of these kind of contemporary uh songs uh such as in the heights mm. um actually that was one of the ones there dear and hansen came a bit later as well I'm trying to think of something else uh heathers uh like things like that legally blonde that i kind of heard of but i just always thought no go back to my roots of like the sure kind of, uh, <laughs> that's really interesting um musical theater but it really widened end up like my uh, you know knowledge to musical theater and just how different like you know people think musical theater singing dance cheesy but actually there's so much like so many different like areas of it um so many different kind of sections and just genres within musical theater mm-hmm. that makes it so exciting and yeah I, I guess from the old musical theater to contemporary that's kind of like how the growth of my knowledge has grown as well like my passion for it <laughs> well that's really fascinating it's really interesting how you had this like pride for the older stuff and then that you started yeah. to, you know, kind of be introduced to some of the newer stuff. That's that's really interesting. 